Hey everyone, welcome to another video on Collector Glitches. Two locations this time, first one Solomon's Folly. Solomon's Folly can be found in New Austin. So completely to the west, Tumbleweed, south of Tumbleweed, Bennett Point, a little bit lower, you find an abandoned farm. Is also a place where you can find a hideout, so careful on that one. Come here, and it's the same system as before. We go and respawn, not do the respawn through the left on the D-pad, no, we do the start button and we go to the online. Choose free roam and you respawn on the same location in a different uh, session, but close to the same location. I'm gonna skip the loading screens because that's just boring. You see where I ended up, really close by. Three collectibles that you can find here. First one is in the basement where the boss of the hideout uh, is located. If you have a hideout that spawns here, I try to go inside, but go up a little bit. Go down the basement, and on in the on the shelves, you find an absent bottle. As in the first video, if you go in eagle eye vision, you will not get an indication you are close to a collectible. No sparkly. No twinkling, uh, no vibrating of your controller, no, it's there, you need to find it yourself. Three collectibles that you can find here. Second one is in the ruin of the house. In the chimney, you search the chimney and you will find a necklace. There you have it. Third location of a collectible and the last location of a collectible is down this barn. On the far end, you have a ladder, go up where you find a tarot card. Thank you to Yuri, by the way, uh, he's talking to me right now, he's just running around. Uh, he showed me this location and the next one as well, so thank you for that one, Yuri. He told me it was on the bale of hay, but it's actually on the barrel where you find a tarot card, the Eight of Wands, this one. And that's number three of three on this location. So we're going to go for the next one. First I'm going to jump out of the window, I think that's cool. Take out your winter jacket because we're going up north towards Coulter. One, two, and three. There we go. We're in Coulter. Coulter up north, easy to find. Um, fast travel point here. If you have 10 minutes left of uh, your gaming time, then uh, you say, I want to get some XP. I want to quickly do this one. You can do this one. Remember, every 24 hours you can do these locations. Every location per 24 hours. So I already showed you the first video, Wapiti, just for Solomon's Folly, and here Cauldron. That's three locations you can do every day if you fill up for it, of course. Same system as before. Start online and free roam, not lead, free roam. You respawn on the same location or close to the same location. Make sure you have nothing stored on your horse or you will lose it. Now the first place where we're going to go is in a big barn. I showed you here with my indicator which building I'm talking about. That's where I'm running towards uh, in a couple of seconds. Here we go, running towards the big barn, but there's only one collectible to be found. It's also a tarot card. Inside, and this time it is on a bale of hay, you have uh, the collectible, the Ace of Cups. Remember, it is always the same collectible that you will find. So if you do this 10 times, 10 times you will find the Ace of Cups on this location every 24 hours. We go outside, we cross the road. I'm gonna show you, cross the road, and we go towards that little building over there uh, on our left side. That's the building we're talking about. You can just see it. Go inside and we will also find a tarot card on the table in the right corner the eight of pentacles outside we take the next house we go inside uh, if you go inside immediately on your left you will have a cabinet you don't have to open the cabinet but you will find the caribbean rum there we go caribbean rum there for the taking there are two bedrooms. You take the right side bedroom of this house. This is a, needs a little bit of um, good positioning. 
Uh, I always end up searching the drawer of the nightstand, uh, but you can see the collectible already lying over there. If there's something in this drawer that you can use, it's there for the taking, so uh, easy peasy. But with a little bit of looking and finding, we find the rosewood uh, hairbrush, one of the family heirlooms. There are two more left here. We're gonna cross the street again towards the big building that we see on the left of us, that one. Go in, at the end of the building you have a table where you find the Seven of Wands. I tried to reach over the table, I thought I could reach over the table, but uh, no. Seven of Wands is there for the taking. And the last one is, if we go outside, we go to the right, you have not the first, but the second half-built building where you find another tarot card. Uh, this one is active, you will see if I turn on my eagle eye vision. There you go, you see the sparkly and the yellow, that's where it is. Guys, I hope you liked it. If you like these videos, subscribe, give me a like, give me a comment. See you next time. Bye-bye.